and wacky that it's hard to use, that they put it on the internet for us to use. So we'll be able to use our smart board today to show us all the new things that we have in our social studies book. But I want to see what you know about social studies. So before I start, we're going to play a little game show. And before we play the game show, I need, while it's loading up, Jamie, could you please go get the smart board ready for me, please? Today's lesson, I was able to incorporate our new social studies adoption, which I never had an opportunity to use before. It had technology in it, songs in it, Everything was done through the web. I was able to go on there, create slides, cut and paste it, and so I could make it interactive for the children. So we're going to play single player to see what you know. And we're going to play Race the Clock. I loved how it had a game show, so the kids were able to be a live contestant okay. and be able to My review first. what they were able to learn today. Um, using the smart board, they were able to interact with the lesson, so it just wasn't a big book that they had to look at or a picture that they could discuss. They could actually go up and touch things, circle things, and be able to make it their own. She didn't even check to see if you guys were right. She was so confident with herself. I like doing a smart boy because we can do because we can do games and we can circle stuff on a smart board and we can do our math on it and, and sing and stuff with it. Well done. I like to play game board on the smart board click the smart board because it's my favorite game. Sometimes we uh, do like math games on it. All the games are really fun and I like them all and every time we get on the smart pod I'm, I'm really excited to get up there and play. With a smart board I was able to create slides to check to see if they understood the vocabulary with those, the sliding of the words over to the definition. I was able to progress monitor the understanding of the questions with the use of the clickers. Take a little quiz with our clickers. Yay! And I'm going to see what you guys know. The clickers provide instant understanding of who gets it and who doesn't through the graphs. The children are able to use those graphs to say, oh, look how many people got it right, look who got it wrong. And then later on, as a teacher, I'm able to go back and open up the grade book and see who answered what and be able to provide intervention for the children that I need to be able to provide intervention for. Question number four. My teacher makes blank for the class. The lesson today with the use of the clickers would provide me the opportunity to use high quality materials and empower the students with the ability to give their own answer instantly with the use of a clicker. So it incorporates the instructional core to a T being able to use high quality materials, student engagement, empowerment, responsibility to the student. I was able to give the kids a chance to own the lesson. We'll have com computers with Carnival Countdown. We will have... And then we were able to break into centers. And they were able to follow up on their social studies lesson by creating their book or creating their own vocabulary pictures or definitions at their center so they can follow up with the activity that was in the book and then we'll be able to share out later. 